morning, I wanted to encourage you that while you are on your journey, you must know how to relate to God in his love, right? Uh, to have a solid foundation. And, you know, I've uh, read in 1 John 4, 18 and 19 that there is no fear in love, but perfect love cast out fear because fear involves torment. He who fears has not been made perfect in love, but we love him because he first loved us. You know, words that umbrella the word fear are things like worry, panic, obsession, overly concerned, right? And fear involves torment. I know for myself that when fear is present, that means I have torment. I have torment in my relationships. I have torment with God. I have torment with others. Whenever fear is involved, right? We've often been taught that we have to be perfect in order for God to see us, in order for God to love us, but that is not true. There is a beautiful di divine love that is God, right? And that connects us. And so I want to serve this as your reminder today that if God said, I want to use you to get something to someone else. So what's the next step? The next step is to receive it, right? You receive it first, right? That love, you receive it first, and then you give it to others. I'm Coach Takenya K, and I want to wish you a happy Wednesday. God bless you.